Hello friends, welcome to my YouTube channel. This is Prasad and today we will look at port security configuration on Cisco switches. So basically port security enables you to configure each switch port with a unique list of the MAC addresses of the devices that are authorized to access the network through that port. This security enables individual ports to detect, prevent and log attempts by unauthorized devices to communicate through the switch. Configuring the IP address of Class C network. Enable Configure Terminal Interface Range Fast Ethernet 0 slash 1 to 5. Now we need to configure the switch port as an access port using the switch port mode access command. By default, all ports are in dynamic mode. You can see here Fast Ethernet is a dynamic port. So type the command switch port mode access. Then activate port security on the switch port with the switch port port security command. Switch port port security. Now, switch port port security question mark. Here are the some option as edging MAC address maximum violation. So I am choosing MAC address first question mark. First option 48 bit MAC address. This indicates that you can enter the MAC address manually and sticky means it is a port security feature that learns MAC addresses on an interface and retains the MAC information. When you enter this command, the interface converts all the dynamic secure MAC addresses, including those that were dynamically learned before sticky learning was enabled to sticky secure MAC addresses. Next command is switch port port security maximum. MAC secure addresses. For security reason, I want to allow only one identified device, so I am selecting one. Now we need to set violation command, switch port, port security, violation. Here are three options, protect, restrict, shutdown. We can either use restrict, shutdown or protect port security commands. So protect mode drops the packets with unknown source MAC addresses until you remove enough secure MAC addresses to drop below the maximum value. So we have already set the max value as one. An interface is allowed only one MAC address of the source device. A restrict mode performs the same function as protecting and shutdown causes the interface to enter an error disabled state immediately. Port will be shut down. So I'm choosing restrict mode, no shut and write. Show running config. You can see here that no MAC address has been detected by any interface yet. So let's wait for 30 seconds or check if your connectivity is fine. Connectivity is working fine. Now we get the MAC address on the interface. Now I am going to create some violations. So connecting this laptop to port number 0 slash 5. Now check the connectivity status. See the connectivity is not established.
now connect the cable again your previous device we can get the reply from the device so we are done with the port security configuration thanks for watching see you in the next video